Hey, how's it going? I hope you guys are doing well. Yeah, it's early February here. It's our winter fishing season. And at this time of the year, a popular fish to target from the beach with lures a uh, Sierra mackerel. Super fun fish to catch. And yeah, I thought I'd put a little bit of a video together with the tackle choices when targeting the species. It's kind of a follow up on a video I did earlier, which I'm going to link in the description and at the end of this video. And if you want to miss this little, skip this little tackle bit, yeah, uh, go ahead because I got, I got a, quite a nice um, bit of footage from the Sierra action the last couple of weeks that I think you're going to enjoy. And yeah, today I wanted to talk a little bit about the lures. Um, you know, sometimes when you go into a tackle shop, it can be a little bit daunting, just the sheer variety and choice and, you know, what to choose. Um, here in this area, when we're targeting Sierra mackerel this time of year, we tend to use predominantly metal jigs or spoons. You know, that's not to say you can't get them on top water because for sure you can. But for the most part, we're fishing deeper metal jigs. Um, I use two to three ounce most of the time. And that's really because of my setup. And also because here, especially on the Pacific side, you've got dealing with quite big surf and you need that distance. So a slightly heavier lure definitely helps. And um, yeah, you can check, you can see some of, these are some of my favorite Sierra mackerel lures. I use most of the time, most of my successes with silver and chrome. You know, I find that color works the best, but you know, definitely some other colors. Um, sh you should definitely have some, you know, pinks, blues, greens. They definitely have their day. And um, in terms of rigging, I just keep it pretty simple. Um, treble hooks and the size really depends on, on the actual lure itself. Um, and here in this area, it's, it's pretty popular to use assist hooks. Something like this is a yeah, pretty common setup. Works well. Um, and yeah, one of my favorites has got to be this profile. I think this, you know, really imitates the bait that we get here really well. It's super effective lure. And um, I think something that's important is to consider the size of your jigs. You know, I think it's important to have variety. You know, it really depends on what the fish are feeding on, you know, the size of the bait. You know, sometimes at a certain time of the year, the bait, you know, they could be pretty small and the fish are really zoned in on that size. And if you're throwing big jigs, you know, you're not going to be as effective. So I think you know, if you're starting out throwing a bigger jig, and you're not getting any hits you know try try downsizing you know a smaller jig and see see what happens you know it can really be effective yeah guys i hope some of those tips were helpful um i really yeah i, I want to thank my subscribers for supporting the channel i really appreciate it and for anyone new on the channel yeah please subscribe it would help me out a lot yeah i want to share the beauty of the bacha with you um some of the incredible fishing surf fishing that we that we have here that we're really lucky to have and also some of the knowledge on the species that we target you know and um yeah hope you enjoy the footage like i say the sierra you know this is the last couple of weeks and the sierra fishing has been pretty good no? um hope you enjoy it and look forward to seeing you soon cheers
Just a thing.